What's up everyone, my name is Alex Costa and if I tell you to close your eyes right now and imagine a CEO, a boss, a powerful man, what do you imagine this man is wearing right now? Let me guess, a suit, right? Because wearing a suit can make you feel and look powerful. And that is why today I wanted to make sure that when you put a suit on, you are doing it properly because you deserve to look your best if you are a subscriber here on this channel. I have a list of the seven mistakes that most guys make when wearing a suit and of course, how to fix them. And by the way, this beautiful suit here is from Suit Supply. They have sponsored today's video, which is super exciting to me because their suits, as you can see, are amazing. And we'll talk about this suit here specifically later in this video. So for now, let's jump into mistake number one. I cannot tell you how many times I've seen guys wearing a suit, a full suit or a suit jacket that still had the branding stitched onto the sleeve here. No, no, no. Some suits are gonna come with the logo, the tags or whatever on the sleeves, other places as well. Make sure that you cut them off. Remove them completely. You're not supposed to have visible logos. You're not supposed to have that big logo here especially. So don't be afraid to remove it. If you see a guy wearing a suit with a logo stitched right here, then let them know. Yo, you're not really supposed to keep that. That's why there's only one stitch holding that together. Just, just cut it out. Also, something that a lot of guys forget to do is the stitching on the pockets here, the stitching holding the vents back here together. That is all supposed to be removed. I know it's a little scary to cut that stitching if you buy a new suit and you don't really know what you're doing, but trust me on this one, grab a pair of scissors and cut it so that the vents can move around. That is what they're for. They're supposed to be flexible. They're supposed to be flowy. Now let's talk about the fit of a suit, quite possibly the most important aspect of wearing a suit. It needs to fit you perfectly. Suits that are off the rack can fit you sometimes, but it's nearly impossible. You have to really get lucky for that to happen. Tailoring is going to be key in ensuring that your suit fits well. The sleeves can't be too long. The pants will probably need to be hemmed or adjusted. Make sure they're not too baggy around the waist. The shoulders need to sit just right, right? A lot of pieces need to fit perfectly in order for you to look good in a suit. That is why getting a suit tailored is so, so important. If somebody offers me a $10,000 suit that doesn't fit me well, or a $500 suit that fits me perfectly, the $500 suit, that's the one I'm gonna go with. It's gonna look better every time because fit is key when it comes to suiting. So if you're gonna buy something off the rack, then make sure to bring it to a tailor so that he can make it look way more expensive than it really is by tailoring it to your exact measurements. But really, the best way to get a suit to fit you perfectly, to look perfect, right? And to suit your personality, your style, is to get it custom made. And I know you're thinking, Alex, that sounds very expensive, sounds complicated. I don't really wanna do that. Well, that is where our sponsor Suit Supply comes in. They have a new custom made program and it's awesome. It's how I got this suit made from top to bottom and man, I love this suit, all right? Let me show you how the custom made program works. You can do it all online or all in store, or you can start the process online then go into the store to get your measurements, which is what I did. I selected most of the details here, which are super cool by the way. You get to select the fabric, the number of buttons, the lapel, the vents, the construction. I mean, you get to pick every inch of the suit to make it look exactly what you want it to look like. It's just so nice to be able to pick every single little detail. It makes it unique. No one has this exact suit that I'm wearing right now, and that is pretty damn cool. So I chose a wool silk linen fabric since it's summertime and I wanted something more breathable, more relaxed, easy to wear. I tend to get really warm in suits, so this is perfect. And this blue is stunning. Man, I've always wanted a suit just like this, and I was able to get it exactly like I wanted. And even though they have so many options and make you feel like literally James Bond because of the options, they're also very easy to make. So after I made my selections online, I went into the store, I got all of my measurements. The guys at Suit Supply were awesome, extremely knowledgeable and helpful. So if you don't own a nice suit yet, you need to do this. They make it easy. They will go over every single little detail with you to make sure that you get the best suit possible. You can also tell them how you like your clothes tailored usually. I wanted a modern fit, not baggy, but not too tight, especially around my calves. So after the fitting, you hang tight, you wait three to four weeks, and you get your suit. This 
is mine. I got my initials riding the jacket here, which makes it extra special. I even added it to the inside of my collar, and yeah, no one's ever gonna be able to see it, but I know it's there, and it's a really cool Easter egg. I also got the white shirt here made by Suit Supply, so it fits me like a glove, and it also came with my initials on the sleeve here. I mean, I even got Mother of Pearl buttons, which, wow, it's such a subtle but beautiful detail. The pants are so nice, I chose not to go with the belt loops and got side adjusters instead. It's a much cleaner look, more modern. You don't need to wear a belt. I love the way this looks. Guys, I'm so happy with this suit. I have quite a few suits and I'm just gonna go ahead and say, this is my favorite suit that I own. I love it. I'm gonna be rocking this a lot this summer. So make sure to check out Suit Supply. It's the first link below. They have suits and so much more, like this polo here that I swear every time I wear it, I get dozens of people asking me where I got it. I got it at Suit Supply the day that I went in to pick up my suit. The link is below. Make sure to check out their website, go through their program and design your suit and get a suit that's going to make you look your best. And speaking of these beautiful buttons, did you know that you're actually not supposed to button the bottom button of a suit? Yeah, that's right. I see a lot of guys making this mistake. It separates the gentlemen, the guys who know what they're doing from the rookies who have never worn a suit before. And by the way, that's okay. Right, that's why you're here watching this video to learn. So there are three button jackets, which are less common, and there are more common two button jackets like mine. Regardless, you should never button the bottom button. Also, when you're standing up, you should have the suit buttoned up, the top button, just like I said. But when you're about to sit down, if you're gonna keep your jacket on while you're sitting, you should always unbutton your jacket and then sit down. It's proper suit etiquette, it's more comfortable, and you're not gonna run the risk of ripping your buttons open when you sit. And this is not because you need to go on a diet, it's just because suits are supposed to fit you perfectly. So, you know, when you sit, it's gonna be tight. So remember, unbutton and then sit. Now, let's go over some styling do's and don'ts. For example, wearing a watch. Can you or should you wear a watch with a suit? You don't have to, but in my opinion, the right watch can really elevate a suit. It doesn't have to be fancy, but please, please, please do not wear a G-Shock or an Apple watch with the rubber band when you're wearing a suit. It just does not go well together. Wear a classy watch. Stainless steel band, gold band, leather band, not rubber or plastic because that's going to cheapen your whole outfit. How about sneakers? Can you wear sneakers with a suit? A question that I get all the time and the answer is yes, you can. If you want to dress your suit down, make it more casual, less formal, then wearing white leather sneakers is totally acceptable as long as it's a clean sneaker. No designs, no big logos, big branding, and also clean like in the sense of not dirty, right? This blue summer suit is actually a great example of that because I can definitely wear uh, sneakers with this and dress it down. I just take the vest out, you know, make it look more casual. On that same vein, don't think that you have to wear a shirt and a tie with your suit. Of course, it's a classic look, you know, but you can experiment a little bit here. You can have some fun. Go for something like a nice t-shirt, not like a weird v-neck, you know, the scoop necks, like a nice quality t-shirt that's not gonna cheapen your suit look, or even a turtleneck underneath and you're going to look great. You could even wear an unbuttoned shirt underneath without a tie, if you want a more casual look that still looks pretty sharp. And when it comes to accessories, if you're gonna wear a suit, please bring your A game, your nice accessories. Pulling out a Velcro Spider-Man wallet when you're wearing a suit is one of the worst mistakes that you can ever make. They don't go together. Same goes for a super chunky fat wallet with Target receipts, photos of you as a baby, and a bunch of change. No, no, no. I recommend a slim leather wallet, something that is not bulky. You don't want anything bulky inside your jacket pocket because it changes the fit of your suit, right? Because you can clearly see it if you have something chunky right here. And the same goes for your back pocket inside you know, of your trousers. It's not a good look. So get something that is thin, something that is classy. I'd even say that a card holder is a great investment here because they're small. They'll fit into your pocket very easily and you can carry everything you need without adding bulk to your fit. Every guy needs a good suit. Trust me when I say it will make you feel and look 
powerful. You will look your absolute best in a suit. So click the first link below and check out Suit Supply. Design your own suit with the custom made program and you will absolutely love it. Let me know in the comment section down below if you have any questions about suits in general and I'll try to answer as many as I can. And guys, you can find me on Instagram and TikTok. It's at Alex Costa. We just passed a million followers on TikTok. So thank you so much. I've been giving you guys short tips there. I also just started a new YouTube channel with short tips. It's listed in the description below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you again very, very soon. Peace.